Hey, so here we are. Now we're going down the bottom. So as you saw, I skipped a bit because do you really need to see all this? I don't know. I will, will show you. It's the lovely scenery that we have. Now I've had lunch. And I had quite a bit of a lunch time. So, you know, I was hungry, so... Uh, I don't normally stop, but we're going to get this done today. I'll carry on through and bite my time and I'll get it done. You know? But, you know, me and her, we are doing quite well. Yes, I have young Cassie with me today and she is over the moon to be in the field with her father. She loves it. She absolutely loves it so much. She ain't talking on the mic. She's just going to sit there and be quiet. Now that is a new change. <laughs> no, I'm joking. No, yeah, she is, you know, we call her, you know, all the names under the sun because she's such a lovely person and she can't get enough of it. So, yes, so, yeah, Cassie is doing that. Here we go. So luckily I've got someone working. That first work I had, oh, dear with me. I come over from um Green Meadows and uh well you know, there's not a lot going on down there because of course we're shutting down and whatnot. Not a lot going on down there, so we're trying to instead of just making them all redundant. We're trying to see where they can fit in. Well, I do not want to see him here again, you know. Right, here we go. One of them things, isn't it? Maybe a father would take one. But I, I really, I really want to give it to the National Trust. I really do. You know? You know, but then I feel like... So what I'm thinking... This is what I'm thinking. I will give it to the National Trust. Now I know the National Trust lease out, you know, fields that they don't really want to do anything with. So what I'm thinking, give it to the National Trust on the understanding that my father could work the ground, you're with me, for your charge. That way, he hasn't got to pay me, he gets it all the time he's alive, and when he's not here, then it just will go to, yeah? So that's what I'm thinking with that. Because he does like being over there, and I like getting him out of um, Dusty Cobra State, because I want to get in there, I like that. You know? And I haven't been back, and I need to go back. I need to talk to my granddad. Right, so that is what I've been thinking. You know? Now, he did say, right, if he does get this island place, that he'd give me the whole nine yards on Dusty Cove. So that would be a way around it. <clears throat> you know, because we don't want it part of the family estate. It's, it's an island. We're not, we don't live in Ireland. You know, we are English farmers and we dried it over in Ireland, but it's so dear. You know, so I'm thinking this would be perfect opportunity Father would be gone to Ireland. We could get a manager. The manager of what he's in uh, Spring Meadows could come to Dusty Cove Estate and run that. I could come over and visit my son and granddad with Nan. You know, without having to meet, you know, who. To say that mother will go as well, probably. Well, yeah, she would, wouldn't she? Of course. So, that would be a 
perfect opportunity for me. Or we could just sell it to him, instead of him buying, we have that, he has that. Now, unfortunately, Grandad is really, really quite ill at the moment. And Father has took over the whole nine yards down there. So, all what Grandad had has now been given over to Father. So if we done the deal, I'd own pretty much the whole nine yards. Now, which is more land? Well, probably Spring Meadow Estate is probably got more um, ground than Dusty Cove Estate. So. In that respect, we'd probably be better off down there. You know? So, and that's only a stone throw from sort of here, you know? Well, it's a bit, you know, but it ain't far. You know? And then I'm thinking, give the whole thing over there to my son. You know, and then it goes to where it's supposed to be, and it will stay in the family. So, I don't know about the last bit, but I'm thinking the other bit, let's just do one deal at a time. You know, we've got to be wise with this. You know, we're talking about a 20 million pound company now. That's got to be at least worth about 20 million. That whole estate, it's got to be in the region of that I would I would have said. Now I do need to get um, you know inspected <clears throat> to see how much it is paid for. So I I would say in the region of about twenty mil. Because that's a big age risk. And of course there is probably about twelve, thirteen houses now know what we own, you see what we're saying, so it's, you know, and some of the houses we've got to go for close to a million, it's just where it's situated, you know, I mean, we could be talking even more money, I don't know, the granddad was, never really spoke about money, and he's, you know, he's still alive, and he's still, you know, with us, but, days of him farming, let's be honest, are pretty much, Nilch. You know? So, it's a shame. Alright, Cash, if you can just stay there with the distractors, I'll just take the computer. Thank you. Oh no, I will see you on my way. Thank you very much, my dear. Abba Vadabba. So, you know, it's pretty much that. That is where we are with that situation. Now, you say what I say about small tractors. Well, this is going up this hill. I mean, we're talking a good 14% hill. No, I won't get my tractor up here. So, <clears throat> so, there we are. So, that's probably where we are with that. It's, it's got to be at least that, I would have said. So, well, I'm not too sure, but I would have said something in that in that manner. Oh, it's cool. So, there we go. Now, I'm going to be a bit naughty at it. Because I know we've got a slight a little gap under it, under this tree. What I saw, not on the tree, what I saw when I was doing my um, judo. So, now, we want to pretty much be down here. Now we have a little pathway here, look, oops, yeah, it's right now. We have a little path here, let's see, there we go, lovely, job. so let's get on our way. So yeah, I, I would say at least 20 million, and I don't want to be paying out 20 million, I haven't got 20 million. But if I can get it for the price that I paid for the Meadow Estate, I would be quid sin. I would. 
So that's just something that I, you know, want to share with you and get some feedback. If you could give me some feedback on what I, what you think I should do, because you know I think it's a good little money maker. I'll be back over in England, so and I don't know what I'm thinking going over there, but it, it's part of the story. So you know it's done, isn't it? You know, that's not saying I wouldn't take another property in Ireland, it's that one for Ireland, but trees, no. Not on that map. You can't do trees. Because there's no Well the council don't don't want you to do it, basically. So there's a pretty much a no way to win, you know? So now I wanna know is this the same as that one. And if you don't know what I'm on about, then look at one of my previous videos and it'll be quite clear to see what I'm on about. And we've got a lot of traders sitting there doing nothing, right? In fact, I am going to tip it, but I want to see if this is a pretty much. But right, it probably is. But I want to try it before. We go any further. Now we've got another test. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, what do you use? Well, that's my duty manager. Now I've got managers, duty managers, area managers. I didn't realise farming would be such a big deal. Now one of my duty managers has asked me to have a couple of days off. Well, that's fine. We don't mind that. You know. So he wants it off tomorrow. So I'm like, well, I'm going to text him back and find out why he's such a sir. I know he's, his missus was having a baby. I know that much. So maybe that is the situation. So, I mean, if I can get this pretty much put away without this oh dear you see that you see it can't you I mean, you saw that live on camera that's not me being horrible to any mapper or anything you see what I mean But, is that going to be a major problem? Because where it is, I'll tell you what I'm, I know. Because where it is, okay, yes, it's, it has gone through the wall. I'm not going to lie for anyone. It has gone through the wall. But what I'm thinking is, yes, it's gone through the wall. It hasn't gone into this wall. So I'm thinking maybe to tidy up all this. Yeah. We shove all this. We empty all that. We stick it in the other bin. And we fill that bin up. Yeah. And it's not going to be a game. None of it's a game break. I am playing this map. You know, this map is the best map. And I'm going to put it out there. In my eyes, this is the best map that I've played. And if anyone has got an issue, contact me directly. And I will put them straight. Because I love it. And I'm not going to put my neck out of the line for maps, but that, you know, I've played some maps, 
you know, and there's some maps that I really like. Dusty Coats, love it. Love Dusty Coats, right? Has it got issues? Yeah, it has. You know, it has got issues. Are they bad ones that breaks the game? No, not at all. We have pretty much the same problem with Dusty Cove as we do here. But where the bit is, you don't see it. It does get through the wall. So, pretty much, there's not many maps that it don't go through the wall. No. Cobra Park Farm is one of the maps. I think, yes, it used to go through the wall. But now, no. It don't. But they reduce the bins, but doesn't go through the walls. So there we go. Spring Meadow. Well, you know what happens to Spring Meadow when it's started. It's a nightmare. You know? Now that is a game breaker for cyclists when you can't, you know, when one side doesn't actually get anything. Now, was that my mistake? That probably was, maybe, I don't know, they're gonna, people are not gonna say it's me or what. You've all played it, what happens to you lot when you play it? You know, there you go. Say no more. It's a beta map. It's gonna have issues. I'll be surprised if it didn't have issues, to be honest. Silence is one of the hardest things to get right. Now, Bullet Bill, he pretty much got this nailed, he is like the bee's knees when it comes to silence, so I'm surprised, I really am surprised when I see it coming through the walls you know, I'm not even joking if you saw the farm don't do the farm so why does it do it there? and it's the same style of bins as well Maybe you thought people wouldn't put silage in there. Maybe it's not even for silage. Maybe it's just things. I don't know. I need to look and see if there's a, a thing come up. See, you know, what percentage. That might be the issue. It's not actually for silage. But why would they put it there if it's not for silage? They're using the silage bin. So, I don't know. So, I don't know. But as far as the game breaker, now I'm gonna empty the other pin into there. Um that'll pretty much do it. So if I want to put more in, I just won't put it to the edge. You know, I'll just start in the middle and it just roll down and it'll be fine. You know? That'll be fine. The amount of times I'm gonna sit there and look at that wall is ten to none, isn't it really? So again. You know? So there we go. So pretty much where we are. So, the landscape, look, you can see it over there, it's so lovely. If you've ever been to Wales, you'll see stuff like this in Wales and Scotland. Big mountains. So, here we go. Now we'll get this done. 
Well, pretty much. We're going to enjoy this. Look at the scenery. I mean, I love this. I mean, forget about what I'm doing. I'm showing you from outside the cab so you can have a look at the lovely scenery that this map offers, you know? Forget about what I'm doing. Just look around. You know, I've been in these fields for a while now, and every time I look around the corner, I'm just amazed, you know? I'm just so, so overwhelmed with what I see. You know, and when you sit there and play a map, now let's have a look. Let's have a look at how many hours that I've played this map. Now. Well, there you go. 58 hours I've played this map. And still to find stuff new and enjoyable after 58 hours tells you what a good map this really really is now yes we've come into a couple of problems with the silage ok they threw the walls fine only on two bins so far ok the other bin at the cow yard is perfect right then there's the nuggets. Well, someone will give them nuggets back. They are not the map, but someone stole them. Okay? This happens. Flying with a big issue in Wales. Well, if you see a nugget, you're going to have it away, ain't you? <laughs> but, you know, all, all joking about. You've got to understand that this nugget thing was one, a new thing for a 17, so. It doesn't even have to be there, I don't know, does it? But you've got to understand that, you know, it is a new thing. Does he have to put it in? You know, I'd rather him not, if we're going to get it wrong. If he got it wrong, Colbert Park Farm, he got it wrong here. I'd rather him not put him in. You know? Or, maybe he needs to put him in instead of other members of his staff. I don't know what the issue is, but, you know, it is a bit annoying, you know, the other ones are under the map, and we go on the map, pull them back up, job done, I don't even know where these ones are, because the other ones at least had rings on, do you know what I'm saying, they were just under the map, you know, go into, you know, you can go under the map, I mean, I can get under this map quite easy, I showed you that already, you know, so if it's laying like that, we get under the mat, throw along to where it is, and pick them up probably, maybe. But, you know. So, but, I'm not even showing you where they are under the mat. That's the hard bit. But they probably are there somewhere. So, I mean, I haven't been looking at other people doing YouTube for ages, I thought. Of I got a knock with certain people and I'm just doing my own thing and not even like responding to them. Um, you know, easy. So that's what I've done. You know, and that's what you're doing. You got, you know, if you're gonna be a YouTuber, you've got to just think, right, okay. You weren't done in your way. What do you want to do? And stick with what you want to do. No, a lot of them do it for us to do for a living, and they really want to give it up, but they can't because they pay the bills, I suppose. Uh, I'm never going to be in that situation where I've got to play. If I don't want to put a video out, there will not be a video. And that is that. You know? There we go. So as you see, this bin, this, this barn, has 
completely changed. It was knocked down, and this was put in its place. Now, is this one going to stay? I don't know. But if we do do anything with it, it will be a bit awkward. Because the way it is at the moment, it's a bit. I just want to see what it's like, really. Just so, uh, you know, you see these mods come in, and you don't know what they look like, so I just want to see. And put it on level ground, it's probably quite nice, but even on level ground, you've got these nice bits where it's not the perfect flying in here. You know, for that, I appreciate it. That one's a bit. No, uh, they're all pretty much in there. Right? It's quite a big you know, shelter. I mean, I've tried loads of different ones. I mean, I might even turn it. I don't know yet. Time will tell with this. I mean, it's nice because I'm just part of the machinery under it, you know. It's in rows, it's got no doors, it's just, you know, it's nice because of that effect. You know? I mean, like this here. It has to be under the shelter, doesn't it? Well, I can pretty much not only get it under shelter, I can pretty much do the whole thing. So I'm looking for a barn now, I can pretty much do the whole thing. Can I? Well, I'll show you what I mean by that. I'm going to move this machinery to a random location there we do I'm going to get my tractor well, lorry pretty much muck this all up so as you can see, this stirs properly right, so basically I need to come out for that run it in What's wrong with it today? And it's because I'm trying to get over there quicker than I should be. Right, so I want to be over here. Well, I've never tried this. It's just there. Right, let's see what's actually going on. I want to put that in. Nice, did you know? Well, I'm thinking this might not work. I need to get over a bit more, but it. Pretty much, I need to be over. See, this is the problem we have with the place. I mean, I want to get over, but then it's hard because when I have to get over, but I reckon we get it over properly. Send post, did it? You post one now. But you know what I'm trying to get out there. It obviously ain't gonna work. But maybe this will work. Maybe if we can do it. 
there's a way around that. Or we'll use another bar. But I want to be able to stack quite a bit in by auto stacking. I'm not worrying about what we're doing too much. So we need to look into that. There's some way around it, I know there is. I just have to. For now, this will do. You know? Yeah. Uh, as you see, this bar might not be safe, but you know the idea we're trying to get, you know? And for now, you know, even if you just use it, like, leave it on there or something. At least we can get, like, free traders that are all in there. I don't know. So anyway, this is me eating time and, you know, me wandering and talking, it's nice to have a little walk in time and yeah, talk about what we could do with it, you know? So, anyway, it's Farm Brown, down on the farm. We're going to have a lovely mod, no, not mod, but you know what I mean, another episode. Let's see what we can do here, yeah, see? So, you know, this bit of land is going to be worked on and played with and knocked down and rebuilt and <laughs> whatever yeah. So I'll speak to you later. So farm brown down the farm. Let's see.